I come from a place far from your own, a place currently unreachable by man. I waited years to meet you, to study you, to be a part of you. I've been sent here to learn how you live, how you think. This is my rite of passage, my evolution into a mature being. It's like Rumspringa or Bar Mitzvah. As younglings, my species is sent to the far reaches of space to study other forms of intelligent life. To accomplish these things, I have to become one of you. I walk amongst you without you knowing. I've learned how you live. The basics didn't take long. You shave your carcasses, brush your teeth, and you wear pointless garments to cover your body. We even expel our waste the same. There are some complexities I find odd. Your intercommunication is done through your technology and not face to face. I find it perplexing how different your species is from one another. Each individual is a separate entity. So to learn all about you, I must change. I must learn every facet of your species. Where I come from, there is no male or female. There just is. The interaction between your two genders is quite amusing. You like the other based on money or appearance and not always for love or logic. Yes, love does exist on my planet. I'm I'll hold you to that. <laughs> well, hold that thought. I actually have to go to the bathroom real quick, so okay. I'll be back. the most discomforting things is how you treat someone that's slightly different from you. Although there are a lot of things I enjoy about you. Star Wars is pretty amazing. And this Pokemon Go is an interesting game. Even the seedier aspects are appealing. Let's make a porno! It's interesting to see your sexual behavior has become less and less about the continuation of your species and more about self-gratification. We're vans. We're just like cock rings. Sassafras! Although this physical human body of mine is having a reaction. Oh, is this normal? I've been here for a while now. I'm no longer an adolescent. My rite of passage has come to an end. I have experienced all your world has to offer. I've assimilated as one of you, giving myself a human name, Dylan Zimmerman, and as my trade become a cook. Still, I am quite lonely. I wonder when I can come home. If I were human, I would enjoy the wonders of this world every second of every day. The air, the trees, my family, the love, the sex. I would embrace it while they last, because what you don't know is soon this will all be over. This little blue planet will be a spot of dust in the cosmic void.
Or maybe not. You never stop surprising me. Your parents could be so proud of you. Mm -hmm.